Tosh, you started obviously with the MVP, Bob, but to ask you about Emma first, um, something Coach has been talking about is how last year's experience has been fueling your guys. Um, Emma wasn't here last year, but she's kind of playing like she's in that mentality. How do you think she's able to do that? She was so aggressive tonight. Um, I'm proud of Emma because if you would have looked at Emma uh, two years ago in the Minnesota series, we were yelling at her to shoot the ball and yelling at her to be aggressive. Um, she's done a tremendous job in, in her overseas obligations, and I think that's really added to her confidence as a player. But, um, you know, Emma is the missing piece for us. Uh, from last year to this year's team, she's a difference maker in making us a championship team. Um, she's putting us on her back the same as, you know, Toy is on the defensive end, um, taking some pressure off of Elena. But uh, Emma is, a, is an all-star in her own, her own, so I'm extremely proud of the player that she's grown into. <laughs> I'll make her after. <laughs> uh, Tashi, uh, 11 assists, I mean, another double-double, 18 points. You said that, uh, I think it was Tuesday, that you were so much more mentally prepared for the playoffs this year than you were last year. What's the big difference for you? Uh, I just think growing up, um, in my fifth year, I uh, spent a lot of time with our sports psych, uh, Sue Singer. Um, he's been huge for me, and not only in my career, but it just in my life and kind of putting my ten toes down. But um, I prepared for this. I've worked for this. Um, I've worked to be in the position to kind of be the poise of this team, um, push the tempo, and be the perimeter defender. So just understanding my role, trying to do it to the best of my ability. But, um, you know, the players that surround me make my job a lot easier, too. Um, um, so throughout the year, you were kind of – People were telling you to shoot, like Natasha was saying. Now you're shooting. How does it feel to be bearing these buckets and you know really making your teammates look good? It's easier to say my shot when it goes in. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, I know that if you kind of have the hot hand, you just keep shooting. And that's what I did. Like eleven like assists with probably all. <laughs> um, yeah, so they let me open and just, I'll take it down. Over here. Uh, I want to, Tasha likes to hype up the rest of the team, so I'm going to ask you guys about Tasha. Can you talk a little bit about her leadership on the court? Well, she did say, <laughs> she did say that she was growing up or something. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Natasha, can you can you describe the impact that Elena has even on a night when she doesn't shoot it well? Does the defense still go to her? Does she do things that, other than score? Absolutely. Uh, Elena Daladon is the MVP because she affects every facet of a box score. Um, so even nights that she, I wouldn't say that she's off. I just would say that she missed some shots. Um, but even on those nights, she's still. Uh, a player that you have to commit to, that you have to respect. You have to respect her shot. You have to respect the player that she is, um, especially on the offensive end. But Elena does much more than just score the basket. I mean, she came up with some huge blocks at the end of the game, some big rebounds, um, made some assists, uh, and gave herself up on the offensive end too, uh, knowing that she was just a little bit off. And um, to have an MVP that's unselfish in that way, uh, you know, that, that makes our team. Toya, you had 17 points, six rebounds, three blocks, <laughs> and defended Liz Cambage. So. Okay. Sorry, <laughs> hiding over here. Yeah, you. Um, you, had, you had a great performance on the offense, but defending Liz on the defensive end as well. How are you able to to have such a big impact on the stats sheet? We all know that you you contribute a lot that may not always show up quite this big, but tonight you really showed up. Um, I just think with the uh, the defense gets me.
Ladies, right here, man. I think I may have asked Natasha this question earlier, but yeah, man, it's the way you can ask. You talked about what the team has used the word fun nearly the whole season. And obviously, professional sports sometimes can't be. What has made playing on this team, besides winning, fun? Toyo or Emma? The team. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we have great characters in this team, personalities, um, staff. Um, you know, everybody's on the same page, and we just joke around. And we care for each other. That's it. said that it's easier to shoot when your, your shot's going in. For you personally, are you somebody who knows, do you need to get in the rhythm of the game to know you're feeling it, or does it, do you come to the gym knowing you feel good? And, and to follow up on that, with the night you had on Tuesday, were you surprised at how many open looks you had tonight? Mm, I'm just, you know, I see it in the game how it is. Um, I just pretty much do everything the same in practice. Um, I just shoot, practice, try to get better. Mm -hmm. and then I see how it goes in the game. It's just some cool. <laughs> Were you surprised at how many open looks you had tonight? Hmm? Were you surprised at how many open looks you had tonight? Um, no. <laughs> 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 no, I'm, no, just basketball. And some of them are not open. Some of them are maybe negative open. Mm -hmm. so, 